Europe's competition chief meeting with some tech CEOs, including Apple's Tim Cook and Alphabet's Sundar Pichai in Silicon Valley and San Francisco last week, ahead of some new antitrust regulations going into effect. Our dear Dubosa sat down for a one-on-one -on -one with her for today's Tech Check. Morning, D. Hey, good morning, Carl. So before Lena Khan at the FTC, before Jonathan Cantor at the DOJ, there was the EU's Marguerite Vestager, the original antitrust bulldog who has taken on big tech and actually got results. She has been Europe's chief antitrust regulator for nearly a decade. And really, she's the one that wrote the mega cap regulation playbook that laid the groundwork here in America, which is going to be increasingly relevant this year. Now, Vestager was in the Bay Area last week meeting with Tim Cook and Senator Pichai, among others making sure that they're getting ready to comply with the next battle, the Digital Markets Act, which she describes as a new era of regulation and a way to actually change, not just fine, big tech practices going forward. The case-by-case -case approach cannot change the business model. You get the fine to punish past behavior, you're ordered to stop what you're doing, and you're told not to put something in place that will have the same effect. So, of course, it changes behavior. But what we have seen is that part of the behavior that we have punished one is reoccurring. Right. So what the legislation will do is to, to enable us to have speed uh, and much more efficiently to see if there is compliance. And we got more effective tools, you know, fines in repeated, for repeat offenses, doubling of fines if for repeat, repeat offenses that companies can be ordered to split up. So we have, you know, more efficient tools, we have a clearer legislation. Uh, and since everything is digitalized, thing, I think the timing for this is also perfectly uh, good because, well, now other companies have a fair chance of getting the better of digitization. Right. Sounds more proactive. Exactly. A new age. Yes, um. I hope so. And with regards to that timing, of course, there's a number of antitrust battles set to take place here in America this year. Meanwhile, guys, the efficiency drive, that continues with Google planning to lay off hundreds of employees and ad sales after layoffs recently this year, too. Bernstein calls all of this the years of efficiency with an S lasted longer than maybe folks had predicted. And as we've talked about before, there could be an AI element here. A survey unveiled in Davos this week revealed that a quarter of global CEOs expect generative AI to lead to headcount reductions. Our weekly tech check piece, by the way, looks at Apple's under the radar AI strategy. Check that out. Um, more efficiency, though, this flight back to quality that we've seen this year, that's really underpinning mega cap market leadership, EVP Vestier's trip to the Bay Area. It's a reminder that antitrust is set to play a bigger role this year. And could we start to see that affect stock prices and the market? I don't think that's out of the question, guys.